Today, we're diving deep into the world of tire fitment and exploring the real-world effects of swapping out your 235 75th R15 tires for 255 70th R15s. We'll cover everything from fitment and gas mileage to handling and aesthetics. Let's get started. First, let's talk fitment. The golden rule is the 3% rule. In this case, we're looking at a diameter difference of only 0.6%. That's well within the safe zone, so no modifications like leveling or lift kits are needed. The 255 70ths tires will fit without any issues. Moving on to ground clearance, the 255 70th sets are slightly taller, increasing the diameter by 0.18 inches. While this might sound like a lot, in reality, it's a very small increase. You'll gain a tiny bit of extra clearance, but it's unlikely to make a significant difference in everyday driving or even light off-roading. Now let's talk gas mileage. The 255 70th sets have slightly fewer revolutions per mile, which could theoretically improve fuel economy. However, the difference is only 0.6%. In practical terms, this translates to an almost imperceptible change in MPG. Aesthetically, the 255 70th SES will give your vehicle a wider, more aggressive stance. The 20mm increase in width is visually noticeable, making the tires look more substantial. The slight increase in sidewall height also contributes to a more rugged appearance. If you're going for a bolder look, this is a definite pro. Ride comfort is another factor to consider. The sidewall height increase is only 0.09 inches. This is so minimal that you will not feel a difference in ride comfort. The change is too small to make a practical difference. Handling and stability are where the 255 70th sets shine. The wider contact patch provides better grip, especially during cornering and braking. This can lead to improved stability, particularly at higher speeds or during aggressive maneuvers. This will be the most noticeable change in real-world driving. With the 255 70th SES, your speedometer will read slightly lower than your actual speed. At 20 miles per hour, the actual speed is about 20.12 miles per hour. It's a very small difference, but it's worth noting. Most drivers will not notice this small change. Switching to 255 70th SAR 15 primarily impacts aesthetics and handling. The wider stance is noticeably more aggressive and on-road grip improves, especially cornering, off-road, the minimal ground clearance gain is negligible. Gas mileage changes are also too small to detect. Ride comfort remains virtually unchanged. For most, the visual upgrade and improved handling will be the main takeaways. If those are priorities, the switch is worthwhile. Otherwise, the differences are subtle.